Here's how to manage your files using Bits Drive Backup on your Windows computer. I'll take you through the procedure step by step to backup your computer automatically. Click on the Bits Drive icon on the taskbar. Scroll down to Manage Backups. In this window, select what you want to back up. But I'd recommend selecting everything, all the files under your name. To do this, Go to C Drive, then Users, and select your profile. This is usually your name. Now we will control the frequency of the backup. I suggest selecting Real-Time Backup, which ensures every amendment to folders and files is backed up immediately. Click OK. Now we'll look at how to show deleted files and restore a backed up folder or file. Click on the Bits Drive icon on the taskbar and select Restore Backups. Select the location where the file used to be before deletion. Select Default View then Show Deleted Item. They will appear in grey. Click on the greyed out file name and right click Restore. The window prompts you to select where you want to put the restored file. You can either restore to its original location or choose an alternative destination. Click Restore and when successfully restored click OK you'll see the restored bits file will appear on the desktop. You may restore any previous version of any file. Click on the selected file, now click on Versions, and a pop-up window will show you any versions you may have. You can select and restore any of these. Now I'll take you to your online account. Click on your browser, Firefox in this case, on the taskbar. From here you can access all your backed up data from any device connected to the internet, whether or not you have your computer with you. From the email we sent you, click on the web address link to open it automatically, or enter the web address we sent you. This is usually your name, followed by .bitsdrive.co.uk. Now on the login screen enter your email address and password that you have been sent by us. Click login. Click on backup. Any computers you have linked to your account will appear. Click on the computer you wish to access. Folders from that computer will appear. In this example, we're accessing the desktop. Click and all the items from the desktop will appear. I'll show you now how to view a photo. You can do the same with documents and other folders. For music, click on Q Track.
and simply double click to view a video. Finally, here's how to restore your deleted files. Click on View Options, then Show Deleted Files. Any deleted files from the last 30 days will appear.